What is up, everybody? Numa here, bringing you guys some more Priestess gameplay. We will be on Ever Sleeping going against a Bonbon. Bon. Now, you see here, I did get the key spawn, which means they spawn Graveyard Gate when you were at Dancing Geisha. I'm communicating. I got Corner House with Alex, and Alex said he has Cabin. At this point, you see the Prospector rotating to a Cypher, and the Perfumer will take the first kite. Now, when you watch this Perfumer, any Perfumer mains out there, make sure you guys do these tricks because she did really, really good. Right here, she got um bombed but the hunter did a very very good thing about dropping a five second bomb and that's the thing you really never know if it's a two second or a five seconds you just gotta wait it out but you see her perfume right there and she'll be able to go back up since the bomb bond went down now it is unfortunate that she had to get the kite so early but she's gonna make with what she has and she's gonna end up taking this tram and i think it's just perfect that the train just you know just pulled up she was like skirt skirt i'm out so as of right now, she has one perfume, she's a bomb hit, and right now we're just cypher rushing as best as we can. So I'm gonna end up globaling Alex at cabin, just in case she needs to take it. And we're not sure if he has blink or teleport right now, but we're gonna see soon if he does or not. Obviously we can see he has teleport now, but I'm talking about in-game perfumer sense. So we see here that she's pushing the far corner gate. That's why at least what I like to call it. You see there that the hunter does an amazing, I think triple bomb chain. And you see here, she's going to perfume back. And she's just working with what she got, you guys. Honestly, she's doing an amazing job. She ended up taking that bomb hit right there, trying to vault and ends up getting terror shocked. Now, that will be the one thing I do not advise. Do not risk that type of thing, especially with someone who feeds off a full presence. People like Sculptor, Bonbon, bon, etc. Now, notice an amazing hunter play by the Bonbon, bon, where he dropped the survivor and went to go destroy the global because he knows that the forward's going to automatically stun on cheer. And she would push the global right away. But now you see that Alex is going to do an amazing dodge with this bomb right here. And he's going to end up hitting the stun. Shout out to Alex for hitting that good stuff. But since I have Tide, I'll be able to get that rescue so he can keep it. Now look how supportive Priestess is. I'm going to end up dropping these pallets for her. He's still stunned right now. You see him go through my portal. That's another two second stun. And he's forced to break one of these pallets. And look, she's going to be all the way at Graveyard when he gets to the middle of the map. Now at this point, the bomb bond's like, why, why would I chase her when she's all the way at Graveyard? That's doing too much. So he switches targets. Now he's on the Prospector. And we're going to see that the bomb bond does put him in a bad situation forcing him to jump since he just put a bomb down and as of right now the prospector has three magnets and you're going to see that he's going to hit some amazing bombs right there right there was a good one he's going to push and actually go into one which is unfortunate and remember guys he's trying to kite a full presence bomb bomb which is really really hard and at this point he has his time bomb boom he goes down with four bombs and at least we got the perfumer to go you guys we got her good and this will become his first chair we know forward still has tied you know we can make this work with three ciphers left but unfortunately the perfumer gets wanted order you guys so he's going to automatically teleport to her down her as fast as he can and lead the prospector on chair now best case scenario would be for me to rescue since i already used my tide so we're going to keep the forwards tied i'm going to go push this free rescue and she's going to just try to kite as best as she can now i gotta admit this perfume did amazing you guys and honestly there's really nothing you can do in this situation with the full presence bomb bomb so you're gonna see here he's just spamming bombs and boom she's gonna go down now i'm communicating with ford i'm like okay you'll get the rescue but what happens you guys of course he has wanted order as well it's just unfortunate in this match but i'm gonna set up a portal for him to go through and get this rescue now i would go get the rescue but since i do not have tide i shouldn't that would be the best case scenario he's gonna hit an amazing time bomb right there but we trust alex he gets this good stun with just a little bit of his football left gets the rescue but she's unfortunately gonna get farmed now honestly in that situation you can't really do anything and realize that my cypher is about to pop and we have one being worked on around 20 percent so we're gonna have alex focus on graveyard and have the prospector focus on the bad cypher aka two pallet and she's gonna end up going down here and chaired so right now we're working with one cypher splitting both pressures and i'm just going to be the middleman after i pop my cypher in the middle and communicate where the hunter is going so if i'm pinging the hunter switch targets uh, most likely would be going to prospector as you see right here and once i notice this movement from the hunter i'm going to straight directly push graveyard and we're going to try to rush the cypher as best as we can you see the prospector is like oh crap he's on me like white on rice so you see here he does an amazing job dodging these bombs boom miss the chain bomb right there ends up using his magnet really really well right there takes his speed boost 
and right here he gets hit from the time bomb aka chain bomb now keep in mind guys the cypher is around 80 percent we have two people rushing as best as we can does an amazing magnet right there he's just trying to last as long as he can for the cypher machine to pop at this point we're just trying to pop it right when it, we can we see it is primed he tells us focus on a coating boom it gets popped just like that you guys so now we see the prospector zooming as fast as he can and we see he actually drops right in front of the hunter amazing mind game by the hunter but unfortunate for us as survivors now i'm gonna end up pushing this gate but then i'm like you know what i might be able to portal on chair but of course the hunter's like you know i see through your tricks so he's gonna end up dropping him and then going for the forward as you see right there now you're gonna see alex is just trying to dodge bombs as best as he can i'm thinking in my head let me just go heal the prospector psych i'm gonna be pushing the gate as best as i can putting as much pressure and we're gonna see here he's just dodging these bombs as best he can and this is when alex is communicating yo he's going through your portal get away from the gate so i'm reacting as fast as i can you guys and i gotta remember this is a full presence bomb bond so all i can do is dodge as best as i can i end up eating a bomb right there but i end up dodging that chain bomb right there and as soon as i dodge that chain bomb the prospector is like let me just pick myself up ends up getting an amazing magnet right there and at this point i'm like i'm just trying to take the kite so he doesn't get hit i know i have one portal in a dream and I'm like, oh my God, what are we going to do, you guys? So you see me here that just dodging bombs as best I can. I know I'm probably going to go down here. And you're going to see Alex rushing that gate right there. Remember, the hunter does have teleport. And you're going to see the prospector ends up going to another gate that's at zero. And honestly, I put this gameplay in here just because you guys know that you do not win every match. This was a draw situation, you guys. And it was an amazing kite by the perfumer, but prospector went down a little too early. And the hunter just did really, really good, you guys. So honestly, I thought you guys should see this gameplay. But like I said, other than that, hopefully you guys did enjoy this. If you did, make sure to like and comment and subscribe if you're not already. Remember, I'm Noomer and I'm out.